So the first time you open a model up in Revit 2019, you're going to notice a change to how your views are organized, how they're displayed. So what you've got now is a series of tabs collecting every open view up top, and it's pretty nice. You've got a little preview, a little icon here, what view type it is, and then the view name itself. Now, if you've got too many tabs that goes along this entire bar up top, you can just hit this drop down. Here are all the active views that you've got open. You can go up here to your um, open windows as well, like before. Um, one thing you'll notice that your uh, button here is now turned to close inactive window instead of close hidden windows. So it pretty much does the same thing, but they had to do a little bit of a modification in terms of the tiles, in terms of how Revit organizes these tabs at this point. So you've got an X here, just click the X to close the view. I can click and drag this to reorder how it shows up inside of my bar up top here. And one of the nice thing, one really great streamlining uh, function that it's got is the ability to click and tear this off. So I'm going to click and grab that tab. You notice now I'm kind of floating and dragging this window out here. But kind of like Windows does now, if I mouse over near the edge, it's going to give me a preview where it's going to dock that, or maybe I want to dock that at the top or the other side. So I'm going to come over here. I'm going to dock this schedule over here on the side. And then maybe I want to tear off my elevations and get them docked down here in this little window at the bottom. So I'm going to do zoom extents there, and I'm going to find my other elevations and start stacking all those up. So I'm keeping my elevations here in this little window. I've got a 3D view open in this other quadrant, and it really helps me organize and keep things where I want them to be and kind of clean up my workspace and get my workspace in a way that's going to make it efficient for me to get my work done inside of my model. So another great thing that this overhaul to my views and the tabs and how this all works that Revit 2019 has is that we have true multi-monitor support. If you remember in the past, you kind of had to grab Revit and kind of stretch it out over a bunch of monitors to see where the views are. But if I grab uh, this 3D view, for example, it's free floating now, I'm going to pull it over here to my second monitor. And you'll see it's it's all by itself. It's outside of Revit. It's hanging in there. It's still a live view and I can do whatever I need it to. If I want to kind of dock this up and pull it in full screen inside of that second monitor, I have that uh, full control there. So maybe I want to tear out uh, all of my 3D views and pull them over on my second monitor and have them um, over there for me to kind of toggle between and hop between, or I want to you know, dock this up and kind of use that Windows um, tiling ability to dock those up, but fully uh, useful, views over on my different monitors and I can still come over here and do the work I need to do. And of course, all of those changes are going to be reflected in all of my views across the board. So um, tabs, new tab control for my views and true multi-monitor support that is really clean and really easy and should really help you get your workspace to a place that uh, helps you get your work done faster.